welcome to instructional videos. Today we're putting together the Eurofit Drift. So to begin, you're going to remove all the parts from this convenient carry case. So the first thing I like to do is connect all the shock corded poles together. So you're just going to insert one of the ends of the poles into the other and using the snap button, secure it into place. And you're going to do this for all the shock corded poles. Now that I have all my poles connected, I'm going to work on the base and then work up. So I have my base poles here and then I'm going to connect them using the numbers. So I'm going to connect the like numbers together and secure into place using the push buttons. Now that I have the base of my frame, I'm going to start working up. So I'm going to start connecting the ends with the like numbers and then I'm going to start connecting the poles. So I'm just going to mash up the numbers and using the snap button secure into place. Now I'm going to start connecting the poles, matching up the numbers. You're going to continue working your way around the display. Now that I have all my poles connected, the next thing I'm going to do is attach the corners, just matching up the numbers. Next thing I'm going to do is connect my top piece together. Now that I got my top piece connected, I'm going to attach it to the poles. So you're just going to insert this middle hub into the top hole, and then using the push button, secure into place, and then you're going to attach it to the end poles. And that's where you want to secure it, is on the ends. Now that I have my frame set up, the next thing I'm going to do is unzip my graphic. And I'm just going to toss my graphic over the frame, making sure that the zipper is at the bottom. And you're just going to line up the corners with the corners. Now that I have my graphic on, I am going to zip it shut. It is just that easy to set up your Eurofit Drift. 